Okay, let's activate it here. Auditioning for the robots in chapter 12. Firstly, here are the two S models. I've uh, given them both the same voice, so I'll be reading both lines. Booby doop. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh oh. Doop. Scrapper Montgomery. Doop. Doop. Okay, next up, the uh, doorbot. What? What do you want? Robots only. Go away. What? What do you want? Robots are. What's on your head? Oh. Well, it's true that some robots have antennas. Hmm. Oh, you're right. Come on in, friends. And next, the administration bot. Certainly. Make model number serial or name, please. Let me guess. He had tiny little wings on his back. Of course. S13 is quite sought after, not least for all the trouble he causes. He was to return to us some weeks ago, on full left facility grounds. Personally, it's our box of paper clips, the fate of the criminally inclined. Meanwhile, as his body begins a career in paper fastening, S13 CPU has been sent to research. His brain, my dear, criminal behaviour is to be studied. At the end of Corridor 3, you realise I could have told you this all in about 1 25th of a second if you had a communications port installed. Oh my, how polite. And such a curious design. And finally, the security box. As with the S-Tonics, I've uh, done given them both the same voice, so... Anyway. Hold. No, I said hold. Not run away. Maybe they didn't understand it. Say it again. Ah, running. I want to read this. Maybe, maybe they stopped progress just up ahead. That makes sense. Well, that's it. Uh, thanks for listening.